Hey and welcome to part 32 of our walkthrough of Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. In the last episode we beat level 4A Rock and Relics. So that was one of the levels unlocked by going through the secret exit in level 4-1 Deep Keep. And uh, there was actually a secret exit in that level that unlocked level 4B which is right behind us. But we're gonna head on to uh, the level that was unlocked by beating level 4-2 High Tide Ride in the previous episode, level 4-3 Amiss Abyss. So, so we're having a lot of fun here in Seabreeze Cove, uh, the aquatic kind of themed island in Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. Lots of kind of swimming and underwater. Uh, so let's see what's going on in this level. And here we are into the water. So it looks like it's an underwater level and a silhouette level. Okay, right there you can see the hint of the K. You just gotta do your kind of roll while you're in that group of fish. It uh, gets those kind of uh, electrical seaweed things that will give you damage out of the way. Just gotta watch out for those, uh, I guess those are the jellyfish. Uh, they sink a lot slower than they rise, so I find it's a lot easier to pass them on the bottom than the top Because uh, they can just burst up into you. Okay, when you roll through that group of fish it wakes up this like giant squid or I guess it's a giant squid. I don't think it's an octopus so Every time you roll in those groups of fish it spreads them out and uh, You don't take damage from the small groups of fish they just spread out, they light everything up, and uh, right there you can see they lit up a little bit of a barrier. Uh, so I'm just gonna do my super move first before I go up there. Just wanna grab up gold hearts because I have these four, uh, I don't know what those are, like blowfish <laughs> um, on screen. So I grabbed up full gold hearts. Now, what am I doing? I was just about to go up to the surface. <laughs> Gotta go back here, and there you go. Hit the jellyfish so I can see. You just gotta grab up these groups of bananas. And there it is, the first puzzle piece. So nine puzzle pieces, a pretty full level. And of course the four Kong letters to get. Now I'm up to the surface through the checkpoint. And right here, just gonna get rid of the one with the spear, grab up the one with the helmet. Up, up to the left, hit the target, and then up to the right for 30 seconds, grab all the bananas. And it's just that one with the basic slow moving platforms. No bouncing. Just gonna rip through this. Okay, and there it is with 17 seconds left, the second puzzle piece. out to the level. There's Diddy Kong there if you want to switch it up. I like using Dixie Kong though. And I'm gonna hit the O and then back into the water. So the silhouette aspect of the level is really only when you're in the water. It goes to normal when you're uh, up above sea level I guess you'd say. Took a hit there so I was just gonna use that temporary invincibility to swim through everything. Grab this last banana. It's just more bananas, but oh well, it's still fun. <laughs> and the right there, you can see the puzzle piece. Just gotta keep up high and grab up the third puzzle piece. Okay, and then these things, you've just got to do a roll through these little arrows, and it opens up the path ahead. So there gets to be one that's a little more tricky, where there's like multiple ones and like a long path, but we'll get to that in a minute. Okay, right in between all the jellyfish here. Oh, took a hit. I uh, just gotta grab up all these bananas in the circle. You can see the N up in the corner of the screen. I'm gonna do my super move, because I've got so many enemies on screen. And that's gonna give me full gold hearts. And that puzzle piece is just gonna sit there and wait for me. And it also gets all these jellyfish out of my way, so that I can just do my roll through this. I got one that I didn't get somehow. And it just swims through. Okay, and then right here, just collect all these bananas that are above the surface. You just gotta keep hovering out of the water. 
grab them all up. Mm -hmm. And there is another puzzle piece. So that's number five. Four puzzle pieces to go. Right here, it's easy to take damage here. Uh, just go through that. Yeah, I'm going to take damage. And down into the barrel, shoot across, shoot up. And we're back on the surface through another checkpoint. See the hanging snowflake sandbag, whatever it is there. Grab this helmeted guy up. Put the bag and grab the star bananas. And there is the sixth puzzle piece. Okay, right here. Just gonna throw him. Don't need him for anything. Slide down. Again, you can grab a balloon if you jump there, and then grab a bunch of bananas through there. I've already maxed out my meter again, and just hop up, uh, go under into the left and hop up there to grab a puzzle piece number seven. Okay, right here is one of the trickier puzzle pieces to get. Just keep loading up your air meter, and then you want to follow these fish as they press down the uh, electric tentacle seaweed looking things. You do take damage if you hit those glowing pink things, so just keep riding the fish around and then go up into this hole. And just gotta grab all these bananas in here. And there is the eighth puzzle piece. So I'm just gonna swim out. Oh, oh I almost made it! <laughs> Instead of falling around, I just wanna swim out because my air meter was dying. So right here, you just gotta hit the uh, that little green arrow with your roll, and then this is gonna keep sinking back on you, so you've gotta just keep swimming fast and hitting all those. Grab up the G. And then we're at the end of the level, so right here, you just want to head around the barrel and pound through the wall. And it's another 30 seconds grab all the bananas. This one's kind of interesting uh, with these angled platforms. Uh, it's really hard to do without having Dixie or Diddy Kong. Um, just gonna bounce in the corners and get this banana. <laughs> okay, and this one does take up a fair amount of time. Bananas, are, I think the main difference with this one is just because the bananas are moving so fast in so many directions that you're running out of time and I'm like, oh, two seconds left, I got it, the final puzzle piece. Okay, and then just back out and all we've got to do is hit that barrel. And that's it for level 4-3 of Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze and Miss Abyss. All four Kong letters, all nine puzzle pieces. Thanks for watching, if you liked the video click the like button, if you want to see more please subscribe.